Hello and welcome to Surprise Toy Box. I went to Dollarama today and I saw that they had five cases of the Overwatch Cute But Deadly Series 5 blind boxes. Now, none of these were untouched. Um, all of them had at least one box taken out, but I watched a YouTube video on the placement of where the items were and hopefully I picked Mercy, who would be in the bottom left side in the back, and also Midnight Zarya. Now I wasn't sure because I was looking through another box and I probably already mixed it up but then even worse was when I went to the cashier uh, I went to self-checkout it wouldn't scan in so the cashier actually took both of my boxes away and then came back with an entire case and I'm pretty sure she mixed it up but when I asked her um which ones were the one I chose she she took these two and gave it to me so I guess we'll find out otherwise my sister's gonna end up with four maze. So these are, I think, slightly different weights. I think um, the heavier one is either Mercy or May because they're both in the back bottom um, side by side. So I think this is the heavier one, so it should be Mercy. This one is, I think, lighter. I really need a digital scale. Maybe I should um, weigh it. All right, I'm back with my kitchen scale. So there's actually some serious collectors that weigh blind Funko boxes, I think, um, because they all have different weights. Um, so I guess we'll find out. So the, this is a supposedly the heavier one, and it is reading at 87.37 grams. And the lighter one is at 72.61 grams. Ooh, so at least we know have, uh, at least we know we have two different figures. Okay, so I guess let's see if I picked correctly and let's see if the cashier uh, gave me back the wrong boxes. So supposedly this is Mercy, but it could also be May. I should have weighed the other boxes. I don't know. Uh oh, I don't think this is Mercy, but let's open it up. <gasps> it is! Yay! Oh, I, I thought it was one of the figures we have because had already because of this plastic thing. But it's, it's to protect her like more delicate like wings. So she has like giant hair and this like headband thingy. Uh, painting is kind of crappy on this chin area. Is this focusing? And she has like again delicate tiny feet with the pegs. She has like this spear spear thing and like yeah tiny wings and here's the base so let me open that up all right so here is mercy on her base it stands pretty well hopefully her hair doesn't make her topple over this is actually a pretty cute figure i wouldn't mind keeping it for myself oh the paint around the eye is kind of yucky too all right let's see if we have any luck with the second box now, hopefully, even if it isn't um, the one we wanted, the Midnight Zarya, um, it's one of the ones that my sister does not have yet. So she bought five boxes already, and luckily ha she has no repeats. So, let's see. The boxes are pretty mixed up now, so I don't know. Let's see. Ooh, it seems like it might be it. A moment of truth. Yes! We got it! The pink hair person! Okay, so this is Midnight Zarya. She does not look like this in the picture at all. So if you look closely at the picture and let me focus that, and you compare it to this figure, she has like pink lips and like her eyes are more anime, I think? And her gun doesn't even look the same. Is this even the right figure? Hmm. This doesn't look like it at all. But anyways, she has like cool short pink hair. A little tattoo on her arm. And a gun. Where's her base? I always forget the base. So there it is. And there we go, the newest additions to my sister's uh, Overwatch Cute But Deadly collection. Let me know if uh, she should get more. 
Uh, maybe I should just buy the entire case. Who knows? Um, yeah, so remember to leave a comment, a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!